Do you want to start a business but are afraid of doing it alone? Do you want to jumpstart one by having the right business partner? Well, in this video, I'm going to share with you 5 tips in choosing your perfect business partner. Coming up. Hello millionaires, this is Fibo Lemu, your wealth and life coach. In this channel, we publish weekly content that will help you earn more income and achieve success in business and in life. So if you're new here, consider subscribing. Don't forget to ring the bell button so every time we publish a new video, you will get notified. So now, let's jump into the content. Tip number one, choose a partner that can bring in resources to your business. This is one way to jumpstart your business. These sources can be in the form of skills, experience, network, finances, and even products. A partner who can bring these resources to your business will surely help you move faster in terms of business growth. Choosing a partner that already has the skills and experience in business can help you minimize your risk. A partner with a large network of people, a group, a number of followers, or connections can help you market your products faster. A partner who has the capital can help you acquire your needed business assets and can fund your business in terms of production, marketing, and even hiring the needed employees. However, resources are not enough. You and your partner or partners need to have the skills, which leads us to tip number two. Tip number two, choose a partner that can complement your skills. Starting a business is never easy. As a business owner, you have to oversee and handle the major parts of a business. If you are currently good in marketing but may lack the skills in handling and hiring people, then you may consider a business partner who is good with interpersonal skills. If you are good with product creation but are too shy to market your products and services, then you may need a business partner who is good with marketing skills. Creating a thriving business can't be easily done alone. Having a great business partner can complement your skill and increase the chance of business success. Business partnership isn't just about resources and skills. Thus, tip number three, choose a partner who has the same vision as you are. Your business direction is heavily anchored by your vision and mission. How do you see yourself and your business around five to 10 years from now? What influence and impact do you want to achieve with your business? Do you see your business growing and expanding to different locations? How many branches will you have? And does your business partner see the future that you are building? You see, it is important that you share the same vision in order to build something that will last long. If your business partner does not share the same vision, temporary setbacks can discourage him or her easily. And instead of building a long-term business faster than you expect it to be, your business partner will be a drag that will slow the growth of your company. Here's an example. Let's say you're very excited with your upcoming updates in your business plan. Days and nights you planned for it. And when you finally share it with your business partner, if he doesn't have the same vision as you, he may not react as excited as you are. Once that happens, instead of being pumped up, you feel his negativity which will totally affect how you will perform in your business. Thus, it is very important that you both have the same vision. Next is step number four. You must share the same values. Which is more important, profit or integrity? Your business brand or orders? More productivity or quality? This is where most business partners argue when their values don't meet. Thus, before going into partnership, this business core value should be laid out and let your potential partner agree. It is important that your values be made known to your business partners and even your employees to determine which ones are non-negotiable and which one can be adjusted and can be compromised. Remember, one wrong move can ruin your brand's reputation only because you and your business partner have different sets of business values. And finally, tip number five, choose a partner whom you can trust. This may be the most important and probably one of the most difficult traits you can find in a business partner, trust. When it comes to money and business, you need to find someone who you can trust. 
a poorly chosen partner may end up stealing in the companies and take your clients or your business ideas and start his own business. Worst, break laws that could get you into legal troubles. Thus, you may need to choose someone that you really know, someone you can really count on, or someone you have experience working with and have built enough trust and business relationship. To recap, here are the five tips in choosing your perfect business partner. Tip number one, choose a partner that can bring in resources to your business. Tip number two, choose a partner that can complement your skills. Tip number three, choose a partner who has the same vision as you are. Tip number four, you must share the same values. And tip number five, choose a partner whom you can trust. Question of the day, which tip do you find most useful? Let me know in the comments below. Remember, I read each and every comment because I want to connect with you and have a conversation. Thank you so much for watching this video. Subscribe and ring the bell if you haven't. If you missed our previous episodes, check out more videos of this channel. Again, as a gift to my subscribers, I'm giving away my free ebook, Millionaire at 22. Just go to febolim.com slash book to claim your free copy right now. Until next time, this is Febolim. Achieve success, live with happiness, and enjoy the good life. See you in the next episode. Thank <laughs> you.